I've been a part of four workshops now. This is actually my third workshop for this tour. He did his first workshop in Herman, Maine. He did a second workshop in Orno, Maine, and just did another workshop in Nashua, New Hampshire. The reason why I wanted to do the Young Americans again um, was for the experience, of course. You could say what it's like, but you cannot really put in words. You have to see it, you have to be a part of it. It was so cool to like work with him multiple times and like even see his growth. So for this workshop, they asked if any of the boys wanted to switch over to be bass. The last two workshops I've done, the tenor part. And so I said, if you really need someone, <laughs> I guess I can learn a new part. Every workshop that he's done has been like wildly different, which is so cool. I was very excited, um, but also nervous because some of the things that I now had to do switched. He had definitely like grown in the sense of just like being so willing to like try new things and like just have fun and like taking the punches as they come. We get to Footloose and he's ready side stage. I'm like, great. And so I'm there and I'm waiting for him to come on. And in my mind, he's coming in from downstage. He's coming in from, he's gonna jump over the riser, something crazy. I'm not worried at all. I'm just like, oh wow, I can't wait what he's gonna do. And the music intros for him to start singing his solo and there's no Eric. I missed one of my cues. I was supposed to sing um, the solo for Footloose and you know what I was doing? I was practicing. <laughs> I was practicing for the solo in another room. However, it was okay. <laughs> That's another thing I've learned. A motto that the Young Americans have that I have learned is yes and. Uh, yes and we just use to, to like show that no matter what it is, just, just go for it because it's better to just try something than to say no and back off and quit. You just accept what's happening and then you just make it work. Even though I missed a cue, I still went out there and I, I rocked my solo. I'm really proud of my performance, even though I missed a cue. Ultimately, that's not what matters. It doesn't matter that I messed up. All that matters is what you show the audience in their performance and what they take away from it.